Welcome to Excel Magic Trick number 681. If you want to download this workbook and follow along, click on my YouTube channel, then click on my college website link, and you can download the workbook, Excel Magic Trick 70, 673 to 682. Hey, in this video here, we have a column of numbers. We want to find the smallest number that is greater than zero. So we need to exclude all of these uh, negative numbers, but find whatever number is closest to zero, but not zero or below. Now we could just use the min function. Click in that top cell right there, Control Shift Down Arrow, and I'm going to do Shift Enter. Shift Enter just puts the formula in the cell and jumps your cursor back up. The problem is min, of course, will take the min, no matter if it's uh, negative or positive or zero. So I need to um, not allow zero or negative numbers in here. So I'm simply going to edit this and put the if function. The logical test, I'll say, hey, anything in that range is greater than zero. That is a logical test that has many trues and falses. Wherever there's a true here, I will comma, and the value if false will be that range right there. We do not need the value of false, so I'm going to close off that. Because we are putting more than one true, in essence, we have lots of logical tests here, one for each cell. Because there's more than one logical test in this argument logical test, we have to enter this. It's an array formula, because we're doing operations on array. You have to hold Control, Shift, and Enter. You can see the curly brackets up there. Those are automatically put in. If I hit the F9 key, I have the randomizing data. It always pulls the smallest number that is greater than 0. All right, see you next trick.